The tour of my home starts from the front door. This is where I leave my shoes. Right around the corner is the bathroom area. There's a sink and a mirror right there. And behind those frosted glass doors, we have my shower. And then behind that frosted glass pane right there is the toilet. Okay, behind me, this is my rice cooker provided by the school. It doesn't really work well. Futon sofa. Sometimes I sleep here, but I have a bed upstairs, so. I have a really large window. And it overlooks apartment complexes and then a mountainous area in the back. So I woke up this morning to a lot of sounds of glass crashing, things falling out. Um, now I'm Noticing there's a tree that fell on top of a car. And then they blocked this road here because another tree had fallen down on that area. Mm. Here's a car that was trying to leave. He's gonna have to back out now. And I think there's still school in session. Um, because I haven't heard word yet if you know, I have to not go to school today or not. The one thing I don't like about this window is that it opens without a screen. So a lot of times bugs come inside. And I don't like bugs. Here's my little dining table. I have here my most recent reading material. Ceci. It's the November issue. Very new. And it came with these cool little special gift items. Here's my Korean cell phone. It's pretty nice. Uh, it's got a 5.0 megapixel camera. This here is my pass card. Um, I can use this to scan to get into the subway system and the bus system. Okay. This is my desk area. comes with the microwave, it's my food. And this is a really nifty thing. In Korea, they use an ondol heating system. So right now, I'm heating the water. And the water is running through the wooden floors down here, right below me. Basically, my feet will feel warm once the hot water runs under here. Okay. This is the intercom. Um, so whoever uh, rings my doorbell, basically their face will pop up here if they stay in view of the camera. My Korean washing machine. It's a drum style washing machine. Uh, basically, it's more energy efficient. It uses less water. But it was also very confusing to figure out. So we have here um, like the regular washing um, setting, I guess. This one is a not regular setting, so I don't touch that. This one, <coughs> excuse me, this one is the rinse. How many times you want to rinse your load? I usually do one. And this one is the spin dry cycle. This is weak, regular, strong, 
After all that's done, we can do dry. Um, it dries in here too, but it's not as effective as the ones back in America. But that's alright. Gets most of the job done. This is to adjust the water temperature. This is if you want to set a timer. This one I can't figure out, so I won't go into that. This is choosing your style of wash. Basically we have regular. This one's like boiling. Mm, all these other things. Just stick with regular. This is the button to open the door. It's actually really difficult to get this open though, even though you push that, because there's no grip. So I use my nifty little ice tongs to pry it open sometimes. Start, cancel button, and the power. Yeah. This is my uh, stove top. I need to turn this on to get the gas in here. And then it's very important for me to turn it off after I use the stove. Here's my sink. I'm in the midst of washing all the silverware before I put it back in this newly bought basket here. Okay. This is where I dry my washed dishes. Up here I have all my tableware. Cups bowls, dishes, wine glasses. I was very excited when I found those so I don't have to buy any new ones. More stuff up there but I don't really want to use it. And this thing, freezer and refrigerator. And it's not magnetic so anything magnetic I put on my front door actually. Not much in here right now. I have to go grocery shopping. But this here is um, something that removes the smell, the odor from the inside of the refrigerator. I just put it in yesterday, so I don't know if it works yet. So this here is the stairs upstairs to the loft area. That's the loft area up there. There's my TV, my bed. So I don't really have a closet to hang my clothes, so this is where I hang my clothes. On a laundry drying rack, my bed, TV, yep. And this area is not actually enough headroom. So you have to bend over and walk around. But in the morning, with the windows open, you get a nice amount of sunlight. It's very nice. Oh, and that over there is my air conditioning system. It worked really well in the summertime. Yep. So that is my home. Thanks.